have to take your seat out to do this. I actually recommend you do not take your seat out to do this because um, we need the seats in place to help hold the headliner up to keep it from breaking uh, when we're actually in the final process of removing it or installing it. <coughs> the only place you would have a problem with is if, if the seat is still in place, the screw there's there are five plugs. One, two, three, four, five. Underneath each one of those plugs is another is a screw. And this one is really hard to get to with a screwdriver. So unless you've got a small ratchet with a screwdriver bit holder or a 90 degree bent screwdriver, you're not going to be able to take this screw out. Um, I have those, so I, I can take this out while the seat's still in place. Um, if you don't have them, go, go buy one. They're 10 bucks for a, like a little kit. And you'll, you'll love it because you'll find it handy. But, um, you can't get to this screw with a normal screwdriver while the seat's still in place. But again, normally you would not take the seat out to do this. So we got first got to pop out the five plugs. Okay, lift up on this end, kind of push down in this corner, push down and kind of use the friction of the palm of your hand and slide backwards all at the same time. So I'm going to be lifting up here, pushing down and kind of pulling back, maybe. That knurl up at the top edge right underneath the head 
that makes it kind of a press fit. So I've got to knock this pin loose. Things that I pointed out, I'm just going to start taking it off. 